Hello everyone, welcome to Coding Culture. This channel will contain those programs whose explanation is either not present on YouTube or the explanation is present but not up to the mark. So without wasting time, let's get started. So today's question is the is binary tree heap question, which is also the today's question of the problem of the day. Okay, so yeah, it's a very good question and it requires a more bit logic okay so yeah i thought to make a video on it okay so what we will be given first of all let's talk about we will be given a root node reference to the root node okay and uh, we have to return true or false which means that we have to check if the binary tree is heap or not okay so first of all what is a heap how binary tree is heap okay so there are two conditions but uh, um, in this question it's only it's not given so many people were trying and uh, were not getting the uh, required answer okay so yeah let's discuss it and after this you will you can solve it anytime okay after the explanation so like is binary tree heap in which uh, first of all like here it's uh, clearly visible like uh, a binary tree will be heap only when if it's a left and right child will value will be less than the root child or the parent child okay so like five in the root child is five and it's left and right both values are smaller okay so yeah it's a heap like here it's like a 10 20 30 and yeah it's uh, simply greater 20 is greater it's uh, smaller than 40 60 but the value should be less than 20 and here the value should be less than 10 so yeah it's a uh, uh, not heap okay so but there's also one more condition okay we have to also check if the binary tree is complete or not to know that if it's a heap or not okay so how we will check if a binary tree is complete yeah it's very simple like um, below the like uh, above the last level every level should have the should have uh, all nodes like uh, here both children every node should have both children except the last except the last level and in the last level if i get the the null like here f f right side is null so there the next uh, nodes like g's left and right child should also be null if like uh, g's left child is uh, not null okay yeah like uh, suppose if uh, g's left child is not null so this will not be a complete binary tree okay so yeah there will be two functions and uh, this question is a bit incomplete so yeah please uh, excuse the gfg okay so now we will check and we i will make two functions and what will be those two functions return if the tree is complete and uh, i will pass tree and if it is complete then i will check if it's a heap if both conditions are met then the tree is a binary tree is a heap okay so yeah let's uh, move on to the code okay so first of all let me make a uh, static both will be boolean first of all let me make is complete and uh, the value passed will be no tree okay yeah so now let's talk about how we will check is complete okay so simply we will i will use a queue and i will move on like here and here and when i will get a leap node i will make my boolean flag i will make a flag and i will make it as a true and after this if i will get any node which is not null and my flag will be true it means that it is not a complete tree okay so yeah let's code it and then you will be able to understand more better boolean flag equal to false let's say okay so i will make a queue queue and it will store tree it will store nodes type value and uh, yeah okay so meanwhile if you are new to this channel please subscribe the channel if this if you have got the idea of this question okay so i will add queue dot add tree and i will run the loop until the queue becomes empty while not queue dot is empty okay so i will run the loop till then and i will keep on extracting values one by one node let's say tp or anything you can take in the whole world okay q dot pull and i will check if the node which i have pulled is it null if tp equal to null it means i will make my flag equal to true yeah it means i will make my flag equal to true else if it's not true i will check if my flag is true if i have got the null value before if i have got then it's not a complete binary tree okay return false otherwise i will add 
my pp dot left and pp dot right okay so let me explain it once again what i am doing here i am simply traversing the tree in level wise and i am checking if i if the node i've got is null if it's null if the node is null i will make my frag equal to true it means that if i have got another node after this which is not null it means the tree is not complete like here frag is equal to true again when i have came here i will check that if pp is not null like in the next node i've got is not null. i will check if i have got the node previously which is null if yes then it's not a complete binary tree if not then i will simply add my left and right okay so yeah it's uh, very easy and at last i will return true yeah okay so one function is completed and uh, let's move on to another function static boolean is heap and it will also get the same node tree as uh, uh, argument you can say okay so here it's uh, i think you should make it your by your own it's a very easy heap okay i will what i will do if tree equal to null this means return true now i will check if tree dot left not equal to null and and tree dot right i oh sorry tree dot left not equal to null and and tree dot left dot data is greater than tree dot data i will simply return false i think that you must be getting yeah because like uh, if the tree's data then its left is not null but tree dot left dot data is greater than tree dot data or child's data is greater than the parents then i will return false and similar thing i will do for my right side also okay if it's a greater i will return false if like mean if this that means if it's not get the case like both uh, left and right value uh, is smaller then i will check for its left for 20 and for 32 okay so what i will do return is heap three dot left and and is heap three dot right i think the code should run like it's so uh, it should run okay so let's check it out for yeah like it's uh, not uh, the um, it's not the heap only okay now fingers crossed i think that it should yeah it's running okay so yeah that's it that was today's question and it was a very good question concept wise okay so uh, if this explanation has helped you in understanding this video or this question in a more easier and simpler way i think the channel must deserve subscribe please subscribe the channel and we will meet you in the next video till then keep on coding jai hind and bye bye